Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. This is the Anthony Ray Co and here we are again. Ay ay ay, we are we gonna be doing people mail this it's gonna be Good great. morning, ah! Robert Oaks. We're starting the day as we always do with a PO positive or pet fee, followed by the weather. PO positive or pet fee. Dale, what's it gonna be? It's a positive all the way, Jack. I went to Moe's Diner yesterday, and I don't think I've ever had blueberry pie that tasted so good. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Thank you much, Dale. That makes me want to get a piece right now. But the weather's first. We'll start off sunny with a few clouds later today. How about some music now? Okay, for oh, what I was saying, I got to do y'all first, right here. For what I was saying, we are drilling mail. <laughs> Damn copyright me without me copyright. Writing is the one I delivered next door. I'm guessing party invitations? Welcome to the Flick Shack. How can I help you? Got a package for you, ma'am. Hold on. You're our new postal worker? Talk about not looking the part. <laughs> I could say the same thing about you. You could, but you'd be wrong. I look exactly like I own a video rental place. If you were looking to cast a movie and needed someone to play the owner of a video rental place, you'd attach a picture of me to the call sheet. <laughs> True enough. I'm Meredith, by the way. Meredith Weiss. Angie, Eastman. So, what brings you to Providence Oaks? Oh, grew up here, and now I'm back to do my dad a favor. Ah, I myself have been here for six years. And what brings you here? didn't grow up here, came to do myself a favor. Touché, Mrs. Eastman. Miss. So your dream was to rent out videotapes? Not a dream, per se. More like a vision. <laughs> Figured in a sleepy town like this, people don't have much to do anyways. Might as well watch a flick, right? You certainly have a lot of them. Choice is everything. Nothing quite tickles the imagination like the right movie at the right time. Hmm. 
Maybe I should watch more movies. Well, it was nice meeting you, Miss Eastman. Uh, call me Angie. And here, someone just returned this, and it should be right up your alley. The postman always rings twice? <laughs> My kind of humor. Well, I don't know anything else about you, Mrs. Temporary Postal Worker. <laughs> Miss. But, touche, Angie. All right. I'll check it out if I have the time. Take your time. This isn't exactly the most popular flick in the shack. And there's plenty of choice, regardless. Okay. Well, it was nice meeting you, Miss Angie. Same here, Miss Meredith. Commander Grace, we have established communication with ground control. How do you wish to proceed? Tell them we've landed the rocket! Ground control, we have landed the rocket! We will now begin our experiments! Um, package for the Evans family? Just a minute! Commander Grace, permission to explore? Permission granted! Yep, we're the Evans family. Could I just take that real quick? I'm kind of in the middle of a lunar landing. Sure. Here you go. <laughs> nice helmet, by the way. Why, thank you. I actually modeled it on the Apollo 11 crew outfit. Wait. What? Meredith? Buzz Aldrin? <laughs> um, I'm sorry. Who are you? What? For real? You don't recognize your old best friend when you see her? Wait a minute. Kay? Great. And now I busted my colander. I knew opening the door in this thing was a bad idea. Wow, I didn't expect to see you here. That makes two of us. Got me there. You've lived in Providence Oaks all this time? Don't sound so surprised. But yes, I married Barry. Evans, I'm sure you remember our high school star quarterback. Mom! Be right there, Commander Grace! Scanning for alien life forms. That's my little scientist back there. She's crazy about space travel, as you may have guessed, even after the whole Challenger thing. Sounds like you're doing great. I'm happy for you. Well, obviously a lot can happen in 22 years, so... Time flies. So, I heard you were back in town for a while. From Maureen. That's right. I ran into her yesterday at the diner. The kitchen caught fire, so your Uncle Stan is gonna have a field day. 
It's Mo's diner now. Like I said, a lot of things happened while you were away. Also, I work there now. At the diner. Taking over the family business, eh? Let's compare notes. Yeah, we'll see. Ready for a liftoff! Listen, I'm sorry, but I don't really have time for this right now. Can't get stuck on the moon on my own, and I have to get ready for work. See you around, Em. <laughs> Good to see you, Kay. Evans! <laughs> Commander Grace, hold up! You'll never guess what I just found. You can say that again. People love to browse the shop and then not buy anything. Okay, but she didn't have nothing there, right? No problem. Mom and Dad have new neighbors. Siegler, huh? Don't think they ever mentioned them.
Admiral, dear. So glad you could come by. Oh, it's quite the emergency. What's wrong, Miss Jenkins? It's poor little Mortimer. <coughs> He's fallen ill, I think. One minute he was full of life, the next he, well, he just wasn't. He's almost catato... Sorry, heard it when I said it. <laughs> Please, Meredith, be a dear and take poor Mortimer to Mr. Mackey. He runs the bait shop by the lake. He'll know what to do. Sure, I'll get right on it. Here, little kitty, come on. Wonderful. Be nice to Meredith Mortimer. Don't shed too much hair in her van now. Bye, Miss Jenkins. Bye, Meredith. See you soon, Mortimer. Oh, hey, lady. I got to do it with the mail real quick and I'll get, get, um, I'll get your animal there, okay? Hey, put you on the candy. Interesting. Alright, little buddy, I'm gonna get hit. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and drop you off real quick, okay? Because it's gonna be a way too far out of my jail distance to come all the way back and drop you off. So, so I'm just gonna go ahead and drop you off now. Alright, thank you. Hey, we are in the candy. Mr. Mackey, I know you're closed, but... What? I'm Meredith Weiss. 
Yeah, yeah, Meredith Weiss. Thomas, kid. I remember you running around the lake when you were yay high, getting into all sorts of trouble. What can I do you for? Mildred Jenkins tells me you know a lot about animals, and, well... Oh, hi there, little fellow. What's your name? Apparently it's Mortimer. Well, pleased to meet you, Mort. Hm, he's a little sluggish. Has Millie been feeding him cupcakes again? I'm sure she has. <sighs> Leave him with me, I'll put him on a diet today. Maybe even catch him a fish if they're biting. With any luck, he should be up and running in the morning. Thank you, sir. By the way, how are you? I'm fine, I'm fine. You go back to running around that lake, Miss Weiss. Okay. Bye, Mr. Mackey. Bye, Mortimer.
Don't go for the swamp real quick to get this out. Anybody else with that wall? Shut! Yeah, I need to go back. Da, 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 da. This is the Yeah. Alright, but they'll have point by key come. Make anything. Oh my god. Da, 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 da. Oh. I know where I'm going. I just came here real quick, you know? Oh, yeah, 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 Says Hoover Dam. Then I visited Hoover Dam. Do these folks order? Hello, sir. Parcel for you. Um, I hope I'm not disturbing, but. Here's a parcel for you. One minute, I'm busy. If you could just accept the parcel and let me be on my way. Is that a parcel for me? No, it's for Bigfoot. You can just put it on the counter. You're welcome.
da 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 That what I do it for up. Do that woman how right here we have been that cat back tomorrow. My current will be coming up right now. All right, we did another day done. Damn, that was perfect. Steve, how are you? Busy as two peas. Added 87 is really getting there. Hey, listen, you've got plenty of time, right? Yeah, there's not much to do around here. Awesome, I need a favor. I sent a bunch of files your way. It's the retail pitch for Added 87. It's good, but not great. It needs your magic. Do you think you can add it? Huh? <laughs> Uh, nice one, Steve. When will the files arrive, and when do you need the feedback? Ah, oh, well, it should arrive tomorrow, and I need it yesterday. I could just send it to your post office, right? Yep, can't miss. Awesome. Mail back to me as soon as possible. Priority mail. Thanks so much. Oh, I gotta run. Okay, Steve. Oh, one final thing. Now let this marinate. <clears throat> add it, 87, add anything you like. It's fancy, right? Yeah, don't, don't, don't tell me now. Uh, I got a jet. Bye. <sighs> All right. Well, let's watch this. Steve's parcel, and a note from Tess. Hey, Em, hope you're doing well. Steve told me you'd want to read through this monstrosity. Not sure if you really said that, but have a great time there anyways. Take care, Tess.
Well, people, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, help, and comment. I'll see you on the next video. I'm out of here.